Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Herdes. I have the uh, salsa casera. And I have the, just the guacamole salsa, the medium. This was sent to me from the company. So uh, they contacted me and said, would you like to try uh, some salsa? And I said, absolutely, because I love salsa. And I not only use this for tor with tortilla chips, but we also use it for, um, like when we bake chicken, uh, stuff like this is great. Uh, when you mm -hmm. bake chicken, you can pour it over the top, and it's very, very good. And they sell it right at Walmart, so they you can do, get it anywhere. Because when they when they uh, mailed it to me, Kevin was wondering wonder if we can get these at, yeah. at Walmart. Because I knew the name; I'd seen the name before. I just didn't remember where I'd seen it at. Yeah, and and we we've, we've never tried it, but mm -hmm. they do sell it right at All Walmart, and it's whole big section. it's not <laughs> expensive. Yeah. Uh, so what we did was we picked up. While we were at Walmart looking for it, uh, some great value bite-sized tortilla chips. We figured that that would be a good way uh, to try it. Because that's normally how we're going to eat salsa anyway. You're going to normally eat salsa with dipping a chip in it. That's how we eat it, at least. They smell so good. Although, like you said, you can put it on some um, some chicken or something. Oh like that. yeah. So uh, this is the. Uh, it says Mexico's authentic number one salsa brand. This is a, both of these are medium, I think. Um, the the big difference in the two of these, it surprised me, is the calories. Uh, two tablespoons of the salsa is only uh, the salsa casera is only ten calories. Yeah, and the guacamole is fifty. Fifty. So it's guacamole. Yeah. So. Um, and I can just tell you. I don't eat guacamole regularly. We don't. So, no, we don't. I don't dislike it. It's just I don't. I'd rather have red sauce than a tomato sauce than a guacamole. They, sauce. they. Um, I do not care for avocado. At, at, but this is mixed in with other stuff. Right. So, so I'm gonna give it a fair shake. Um, I'm gonna try it. I mm. might really like it. Um, so, but the ingredients are pretty. Um, uh, pretty clean. It's tomatoes, onions, chili peppers, less than two percent of salt, cilantro. Um, and then calcium chloride and citric acid. That's all that's in this. No, mine has a lot more than that. <laughs> and it was uh, distributed by Mega Mix Foods. Mega Mix Foods are the ones that contacted me and um, sent it to me. Okay. This is the man. When you don't have a man, I could have just oh, shit. This is the man. I didn't ask him. No, I know I have a man, but we if you. <laughs> If you don't, Insulting. if you don't have a man, in no, home, these are excellent because I've used wonderful. these too. Yes, if you these don't, will even get uh, Coke bottles off. Yeah, if your man isn't at home, grab that. Or if you got weak um, grip in your hands, it helps. Okay, so mm, it smells this is wonderful. It does smell wonderful, and it's very chunky. chunky. I like it chunky. Yes, very chunky. I got chunkies also. So I'm gonna get a big. Yeah, I'm gonna get a rude amount of salsa on mine. Okay. Normally, I wouldn't get that much. Normally, I would get that much. Oh, always. If I had thought about it, I would have bought the Tostito scoops. I love the scoops. They're the ones that are um, shaped like a bowl. Mm -hmm. They're really good. <laughs> that has a very good onion and garlic flavor. Mm -hmm. It's it, good. It's... Um, it's not hot at all, though. Mm, no, it's, it's just tomatoey. Yes, it says it's a medium. I don't even know if this says medium. It, it does. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 yeah there's no heat at all. Not at all. No, I mean, not even the least bit. So mm. I know a lot of you cannot handle heat, and you might be afraid to even go from the mild to the medium. Other brands that I've had, other brands that I am used to, accustomed to buying. They do have some a little bit of heat to them, just a little bit to let you know that you're eating medium. This one, you would be safe to, to yeah, have. Yeah, unless you can't handle onions and garlic, that's the only thing. Yes, you, and maybe a little bit of a green pepper, maybe, but that's about it. Yeah, yeah. there, there. This would be totally fine for you because there's no spice no. Uh, at all. No, my only complaint about it is it's got a lot of liquid. But, that, but it could be that the, all the liquid was on top and now all the chunkies in the bottom. That's what it looks yeah, like. Yeah, that's what it seems like. Yeah, it, there, it is still very liquidy. Yeah. But so if you were to pour the whole thing in a bowl or put it in a, in a mix of some kind, it would mm -hmm. be pretty fine, I think. 
I do think, yeah, that a lot of that liquid was at the very top. Or if you spoon it out, I think it would be fine. I like it though. I think it has a good flavor. I like the onion in it. Mm -hmm. um, it's it. Um, it almost tasted like it had some garlic to me. Yeah, garlic and onions, what I got. Yeah, too. and tomato, okay. very strong tomatoes. So now, and you do refrigerate these after opening. So this is the guacamole. It is also a medium. And let's see. There's it, a lot more ingredients. It has <laughs> uh, water, uh, tomatillos, soybean oil, green chili peppers, avocados, onion, cilantro, natural and artificial flavors, less than 2% of dehydrated onion, uh, salt, Have you hit lime in? juice. Oh yeah, avocado okay. was the one, two, three, four, five. Okay. So there's a ingredient. Fifth one. Yeah, there are a few other things in there. So. Yeah, I want to see what it smells like. Mm, doesn't it smell good. <laughs> I'm sure the, when the company contacted me, they didn't ask me which ones I would like to try. Because we would have never. I would have told them I don't care for avocado. I don't, I wouldn't have chosen the guacamole, but I'm glad they sent it to me so that I can try it. it what do you think? It's spicy. Oh, it oh, is. It's a lot spicier. Okay. I mean. Now you won't think it's spicy. I don't want to eat any more of it though, because I don't like the flavor. You don't like the flavor? I don't like that guacamole flavor. I just wow. don't. It's spicy. Yeah, <laughs> it sure is. Now see, to me, that seems like a hot. I know. <laughs> that, that, it's, it's got some burn in the back of your throat. Whereas yeah. the other one was nothing. No. No, it's amazing the difference. It's night and day. Um, but I, I do like the heat in that. Yeah, I like the heat too. That's a nice heat and it kind of goes away after a while. Mm -hmm. So it doesn't stay around. I just don't really like the flavor. I don't, I don't mind it. It's, it, um, I don't mind it. It's not something that I would say I don't like it. Um, I'm not accustomed to eating avocado. I think if you eat avocado all the time, I think you're going to love it. But you need to know it's going to set you your mouth on fire. Yeah, it's, it's, I mean, it's gone now, but it, it yeah. lasts for a little while. Yes, there is. And, it, and it, the flavor is very, very strong in that, too. It is. Yeah, it's strong. Yeah, I think... It's very lime. I get a really strong lime flavor. I taste the avocado, mm -hmm. which is the flavor I don't like. Right. Um, I, but I do think... Yeah, like I said, the company sent this to me. They didn't know. I think if you... You like avocado, you eat avocado. Some people put it on their sandwiches and everything. Yeah. If you're already eating that stuff, you know you like it. So then you're th going to love th this. You're going to like yeah, it. Yeah, but just know the medium is going, yes, it, yeah, it'll set your mouth on fire. But now the medium of this is like a mild. Mm -hmm. yeah, so out of the two for us, <laughs> we the it goes without saying. The salt. Yeah. The We're going to go for this one. This is really good. So, because we like that garlicky, onion flavor. Tomato flavor. So, the tomato flavor. So, I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.